Hi, my name is Joshua, Joshua Cheong. I'm uh, from Parity and I'm part of the Substrate Builders program as a program manager. So what I do is I help uh, different high quality teams that come into our ecosystem to learn Substrate and Substrate development to become ready to become blockchains or we call them parachains on the Polkadot ecosystem. Well, the two words I'll use, uh, and it was from a recent talk I did with SubWallet, uh, it, it is decentralization matters. Decentralization matters. And the reason I would say is, uh, you know, two key mega trends happened this year. Geopolitically, there's a major breakdown of centralized trust. Some of the largest economic nations in the world, you know them, the drawing lines on the sand, uh, international trade has been unraveling ever since Ukraine war broke out. And let's not forget there's huge global inflation everywhere of all major economies. And this has not occurred in the magnitude we see today since the 1970s, almost more than a generation ago. The second key trend in Web3 industries, we learned that many of the projects that seem to be superstars and strong competitors in the space who claim to be part of the Web3 movement, in reality are motivated by something different. This show to us that a lot of this has been built on a house of cards and it cannot stand. So both from this uncertainty of the global environment and even in the blockchain industry, it really highlights that the culture and technology of decentralization matters much more than ever before. So in my opinion, we will look back at this year as a catalyst for great geopolitical and economic change. It will trigger the need for trustless systems of coordination, even at the nation state level. So this will scream a change for decentralization. And we believe that Polkadot Network and its underlying substrate technology is the means to achieve this. The Substrate Builders Program uh, started as a program even before Polkadot uh, was a technology that's live and, and ready for use. So our mission has always been to ensure these high quality teams adopt these high quality practices of blockchain development using Substrate to deliver parachains. So since then, this year we have over 75 parachains uh, from, uh, from, from both Kusama and Polkadot and they are adopted uh, well uh, across the year and each one of them actually represents a sovereign economic system of governments and utility. So things from carbon credits to smart contract systems to decentralized finance. And what's great is that um, we have 75 to 80% of them as part of this builders program. So we now develop a thriving ecosystem of developers for Web3 using Substrate and I might argue for blockchain development, one of the largest in the world. So 2023 will be a year for strategic growth uh, for Polkadot. So we're building automation and process re-engineering to make sure the majority of our processes that work well uh, in learning and development for builders, they do so with the community as seamless as possible. So in decentralization, we want to do that even within our company and within the Polkadot ecosystem, not just as a technology, but as a culture and as a way of doing things. So we recognize the need to remove ourselves. So people like me as a dependency or the program as a dependency, 75 to 80% of them come through pro pro our program, but that is great, but that is also a challenge of centralization. We want to decentralize the way we approach our development and our education. Instead, we focus on community contribution and development to have self-help resources, processes, and whatever works, we will double down our efforts. And whatever doesn't and does not make sense, we will move it. And this is done really because we anticipate massive scale to support hundreds of parachains and parathreads uh, sustainably without costing too much resources. So that's what I'm excited about 2023.